Hey Margie, this is Josh for Calips Ford Lincoln and behind me here is the 2017 F-150 that you've inquired about. So without further ado, let's take a closer look at this truck and see some of the cool stuff that's included on this particular F-150. So here's a look at the truck on the outside. Uh, using our key fob here, we've got a few controls. So this truck has remote start, of course, built right in. Fires up right away with the 3.5 liter EcoBoost. Walking around, we've got the black mirrors here as well as the black hooks up front chrome bumper and grill here's a look at this these are the 20 inch uh, aluminum wheels running boards here on the mirrors uh, is our LED spotlight which we can use to illuminate around the truck having a look on the other side there is the blind spot system, kind of hard to see, but there it is. Uh, that will illuminate when somebody's in the truck's blind spot, of course, helping to aid in visibility. We've got color matched handles. 4x4 logo on the box. This truck also features a remote tailgate release controlled by the key, so we'll have a look at that. There's also the tailgate step built into the back of this truck here. So, great aid for getting in and out of the back of the truck. and. Uh, this makes it safer in the winter, jumping in and out, uh, and uh, a pretty popular function overall. We've also got LED lighting uh, in the back of the truck, which we can control from here. So I'm just going to push the button, and those come on over there, and as well here. There's a total of eight tie-down points in the back of the truck, uh, so great for strapping down all sorts of different loads. This one is the five and a half foot uh, box, and of course with the tailgate down, it's nearly seven feet long. Let's have a look uh, inside the truck. Back seats on this generation of the crew cab are absolutely huge. They of course fold up and you have a completely flat floor here, which is fantastic. Lots of space for storage here. Having a look at the back of the console, there's a 110 plug which you can use for all sorts of things, tools, electronics, uh, run blenders out camping, run a winch, all sorts of stuff. A couple of USB ports and a 12 volt as well. So let's uh, hop inside the truck and go up front and have a look uh, what's in there. In the front seat here, we have uh, a bunch of controls on the door here. We've got three memory settings for the seats, uh, as well as power, windows, locks, uh, and then of course mirrors will also fold in at the push of a button as well. Over here we've got the seats, uh, which are heated and cooled leather with lumbar support. Well, let's jump in and have a look at some of the controls. Here we have our controls for our side mirror spotlights, uh, as well as our automatic headlights down here. We have adjustable gas pedals, so we can bring those back and forth. Uh, great if your legs are a little shorter than the last person driving the vehicle. In the center here we have a lovely big display, so let's close the door, turn it on, and see what it all looks like. With this generation of truck there's the push button start, of course, and everything fires up nicely. So in the center stack here, there's a ton of different information available depending on uh, what's important to you at the time. You can essentially configure this menu to display a whole host of information. Everything from trailering, navigation, engine information, fuel economy, off-road, uh, and then of course the list goes on and on. We've got cruise control, media controls here, and then uh, full voice command and phone control here. So the voice commands on this generation are really great. So for example, we can control all of our navigation, radio, uh, and phone using our, our voice commands. 4x4 controls on this truck, very easy to use. We have two high, an automatic 4x4 system, full-time four high, four low, as well as a locking rear differential, great for tougher situations. This truck, of course, also has Ford's trailer backup system, which can help you back up a trailer. Essentially, you'll use this knob, rather than the steering wheel, to control your trailer. Also a built-in brake controller, uh, ready to go for all your trailering needs. We've, of course, got dual-zone climate control on this truck, so separate driver and passenger temperatures, um, as well as the heated and cooled seats up front, which are absolutely fantastic all year round. So there we go. There's a quick look at this truck. Um, of course, there is no sunroof, as we've discussed, uh, which can be uh, an advantage in many scenarios. So there we go. Uh, quick look in the mirror. Auto dimming, as well as the uh, side view as well. So no more bright headlights coming through at night. And uh, yeah, there we go. Really good looking truck, lots of space, tons of room. This generation has a bigger interior than the 2009. Um, so you'll be uh, very pleased with the amount of space that this uh, has to offer, of course. So. There we go. Thanks for checking it out.